imagine something that you could not possibly obtain. A object of pure bliss. May it be billions of dollars, a relative coming back from the dead, etc. There is a way to obtain that, at a cost. There are many rituals like this, but this one is one of the strangest. Follow these steps, for your wish to come true. First of all, you must acquire four objects. A flashlight, any doll, and raw meat, preferably chicken. You should also bring a weapon, and soda, although this is optional. To avoid losing sanity, you should also bring a precious possession, as these games are quite stressful, with your life on the line at all. To start the ritual, head into any bedroom at your house at approximately 10 p.m. Go to the center of the room, take out the doll, and say the phrase provoke OT. Relinquit corpus to Anno Sire Lunarin. Boss Sidus Astyphotibius Suspendi. Note that it is okay to have a notepad or something else on you to help you remember the phrase. Afterwards, destroy the doll in any way possible, this is where the weapon comes in handy. Once you are finished destroying the doll, go to sleep. You will wake up at 11.55. You have 5 minutes to prepare. Take out the flashlight, close all doors and windows, and get in a hiding place. After the 5 minutes, the creature enters your house. Now one of three things will happen. Either the creature is passive, and enters your room and drops the object you wish for next to itself and waits in your room. If you hear an object thudding against your floor, it is likely this. Wait 5 to 10 minutes for the creature to leave your room. Do not come out before then, as the creature will consume you whole. If you come out and don't get eaten, congratulations. You win. Enjoy your prize. The second thing that happens, is when the creature is aggressive. You'll know when this happens if a faint scratching sound is heard. That means the creature has accepted, and is now playing the game. Come out of your hiding place and open the door or doors to the room. Power on your flashlight, and prepare. You must survive until 6 a.m. The creature will try to get in through the doors. Do not let him. You cannot exit your room however, as the creature will kill you instantly. Check the doors periodically. If you hear breathing, coughing, or moaning, shut the doors hard, but do not lock them. Wait until the sound passes, then open the doors shine the flashlight out of the room. If you don't hear breathing, just shine the flashlight out of the door. Do not, I repeat do not shine the light when you hear the breathing, as the creature will see you and ingest you, and you must shut the doors when you hear the breathing, as the creature will hear you walking away, and open the doors when the sound passes. The last thing you must not do, is fall asleep, as the creature will kill you during your sleep. This is where the soda comes in handy, as the caffeine keeps you up. At 3 a.m., you must also start checking under your bed, shine the flashlight under your bed, and if the creature is there, it will run away. If you survive until 6 a.m., you win that round. Every night, a new round starts at 12 a.m., prepare your hiding spot for the next night. Survive for 5 rounds, and you win. Your prize will be in the driveway. The third thing that will happen is that the creature refuses to play. To coax it into playing, take the raw meat, and lay it in your room. The creature, whose appearance varies on what doll you pick, typically a nightmarish version of the doll, but much taller, will enter the room and consume the raw meat. Take passive creature protocol afterwards. You have survived and won your prize. But there is one catch to winning. Something you love, will go missing one year later. Protect what you love, at all costs. You can only play this game six times, anymore, and the ritual won't work.